Assalamu alaikum. My name is Ryan Afridi, and in this video, we are going to talk about the automating the whole process of finding an IDOS. It will be easy, and for that, we are going to use a tool named Authorize for finding an IDOS. Okay, so I'm going to first download that tool from extensions, go to extensions, and then go to the Bay App Store, and right here, say Authorize right here okay why you say authorize just come here and then just install it and if you are saying if you are having the problem with jython go to any chrome your any browser you are using and search jython right here click on the jython standalone and while it's downloaded go to extension settings and when it's downloaded select file and select the standalone file okay now come back and right here i'm going to turn on my uh, browser okay now right here what i'm going to do i'm going to go to the juice shop or our juice shop here we are going to find some bulb not some just one idea okay now let me turn on my authorize while it's on let me refresh this page once more once again and i will get a request and we don't need that but we can you can check it out but we don't need that okay now just leave it to scan the whole thing and let me do that for more good can I do it more? No, okay. Okay. You found nothing. So, what you're gonna do, we are gonna do some uh, interaction on the page on the site. So, we're gonna do some add to basket things, okay? And while adding it, we see a request is being bypassed. So, it means that it may work. We can bypass it and it may work. So, what we can do now on the modified request we are as you can see we have the authorization and uh, it is inserted injected the cookie is injected okay and now when I go to modified response the I see data success and it's zero because there's no user so now what I can do it's a good thing just send this to an repeater tab and right here I'm gonna send this to test once more once again and when I send it, it will say nothing. Success. But, 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 but. As you can see, there's a number. There's a number. So, while interacting with the numbers, as I said, a wasp, uh, I mean, while interacting with the numbers, ideas can be found. Just by interacting with the numbers you found. Okay. The IDs, basically. Not the numbers. Just don't interact with any number you see. Just be IDs. Okay. Now, right here, we can say 1 and id maybe pop up nothing the id one has nothing in the, their basket so now two and we found something in their basket okay the raspberry juice made from blended raspberry pi and you can save this data for with yourself for better explanation and for your type of one so no just don't go anywhere okay right here you have to find more and more okay find more and more because if you just stop right here maybe uh, you are not accessing the others data. You are just seeing your data. Okay, so now just go to re and see if anything changed It's the same nothing changed, but what if I say four maybe something? Yeah, I know maybe not something and now what if I say five anything? Okay, there's two uh, things with uh, on ID 5 and ID 4 this is ID 4 and this is ID 5 which which has a 500 millimeter the id basically i think this is id for the juices i think yeah yeah this is for the juice this id is for the juice and this id is for our uh, basket and that's how you can find an address now if i uh, go for six maybe there will be no one but maybe okay there is someone and also they have bought an 100 millimeter apple juice and now if i say seven just check for everything maybe it's not and maybe it is so just check see now they have banana juice and they also have a description and yeah that's how you find that that's that's easy it is 
and we just you we just use authorized tool which is more easy so don't just find it manual okay don't find idle manual with the help of authorize you can find it okay what we have done just refresh the page and watch for uh, everything you can right here and then just uh, get the request in the authorize and then just find any value that is being bypassed for example there's a zero right here so just uh, uh, work with that and also as you can see there's a rest user who maybe we can also check that maybe if something uh, happened let me go to repeater and right here if I ch check this one to one or maybe zero and expected part rest user okay and expected path let me go to two and expected path again and internal server error so you can just check it something like this okay just same like this or maybe what is my name let me uh, let me say in the human mind maybe if it's found something about me that will block illegal activity by ff okay no it's got a second we made something illegal activity or what let me go back to that okay something is wrong okay this was an illegal activity yesterday okay so sorry for that and that's how uh, you can work with your ideas with an automated way thank you take care allah office